Hello everyone, Chief Canuck here, and today I'm going to be breaking down the contents within the different editions of Halo 5 Guardians. There are four editions for the game. There's the Standard, which you can get in physical and digital form. There's a Digital Deluxe Edition, a Limited Edition, and a Limited Collector's Edition. The Standard Edition is $59.99 for both the physical version or the digital version. It comes with the game. If you buy the physical version, you get an Xbox Live Gold 14-day trial. If you pre-order the digital version through the Xbox Marketplace, you get a bonus loadout weapon and custom skin for Warzone multiplayer as a pre-order bonus. Also available through the Xbox Marketplace is the Digital Deluxe Edition, which is $89.99. It comes with the game, it also comes with the pre-order bonus loadout weapon and custom skin for Warzone. It comes with a Warzone Rec Bundle, which includes 14 premium requisition packs, with two releasing on a weekly basis, and it also comes with Halo The Fall of Reach animated series. This animated series explores the origins of the Master Chief and Blue Team, and this will stream via the Halo Channel app on Xbox One. There's a limited edition which is basically $100 that you can get at your local retailer. It comes with a Halo 5 disc, a uniquely designed Spartan themed steelbook, Spartan Locks classified orders, dossiers on Blue Team and Fire Team Osiris, a Guardian model by Metal Earth, the Halo The Fall of Reach animated series, the Warzone Rec bundle with 14 premium rec packs, and an Xbox Live Gold 14 day trial. There's also the Big Granddaddy, the limited collector's edition which is $250 at your local retailer. It comes with everything in the limited edition and it has a commemorative statue designed by 343 Industries. The Master Chief and Locke appear as a team, but the statue is able to split apart so you can separate the two characters and essentially use them as bookends. However, this bundle does not come with a disc even though it comes with a steelbook. It comes with a code to download the game digitally. This is because the limited collector's edition will ship a week before the game actually launches. Halo 5 Guardians launches on October 27th, 2015, and the limited collector's edition physical contents will ship on October 20th. So you'll get everything a week early and you'll have plenty of time to redeem the code and pre-download the game on your console so it's ready to go once the game goes live on October 27th. This doesn't mean you get to play the game early, this just means you can download it and have plenty of time so it's ready to go right at midnight. This only applies to the limited collector's edition, not the limited edition. The limited edition comes with a disc and will release on October 27th. And those are the four editions available for Halo 5 Guardians. If you decide to go down the digital route, you can go to the Xbox store right now, go online and pre-order and pre-load the game and start downloading it right now. Obviously, it won't work until the game releases on October 27th. Now, some of you guys may have noticed that pre-order bonuses are popping up at different retailers, like these from GameStop and Amazon. From GameStop, you get the Sentinel Battle Rifle with Laser Targeter. The apparent value of this battle rifle is that it has improved overall weapon accuracy even when not using precision aiming. You'll also get the Bloodthirst Battle Rifle Weapon Skin. From Amazon you get the Projection SMG with Long Barrel. The description on Amazon says that the SMG is a compact, fully automatic firearm used by the UNSC, and this pre-order bonus code will be emailed to you within two days of the completed shipment. Now, I'm just going to speculate that normally when you see the words Long Barrel as some sort of modification or attachment, that usually means that it has better range. Now both of these retailers have a specific weapon and skin as a pre-order bonus, and these weapons are presumed to have better stats based off of their description. But do not worry, these particular weapons are only to be used in Warzone multiplayer. Only cosmetic items, whether it's from a pre-order bonus or from a rec pack, will work in both Arena and Warzone. Arena is the competitive multiplayer. So you'll be able to use the weapon skin in both Arena and Warzone, but the different version of the weapon can only be used in Warzone multiplayer. Now these are the first two pre-order bonuses that have surfaced and more definitely will. I'll try my best to update the description and keep you guys informed as they surface. However, the best way to stay up to date is to follow me on Twitter at Chief Canuck to get the news when it happens. Thank you guys for watching, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to like and subscribe for more awesome Halo news and content. My name's Chief Canuck and I'm signing out.